Hi and welcome back to some more tips and tricks. Today we're in this, the, well we're still in the derelict void, but we're in this big room with the tree that's basically growing in the middle of it. You, this, I've seen this quite a lot. Now, there is actually a few things here, but nine times out of ten you, you can find all of them pretty easily. Because that leads to one... This leads to another, well it doesn't, it leads to a lift that goes nowhere, but usually there's a container in it. This time there wasn't. Downstairs is actually where we came into this area. But one air thing that's, I've seen a few people neglect it. It's just down here actually. It's just there. Now, one of the easy ways to get to it which is actually where we came in, because we came past the damn thing. If I'm remembering right, that is. In here, and through this tube. Now, from here, you basically want to run and jump to the opposite side. And then another pipe. Now, you will be careful, the water is electrified. But you can't stand on the rocks. Now, the, the best trick to this is... Shoot that thing over there. It'll explode. Give it a second. The electricity stops. You can walk on the water. Now, it doesn't seem like much, but you gotta remember this is the derelict. We've got a chance of getting the... the Gollum Nav coordinate balls from the uh, lockers. Um, mutagen samples. In the derelict void, you literally have to hit up every loot room you can find. And this one is actually a bit of a weird one because there's a little ledge underneath her that I have not found a use for. I am almost sure this serves a purpose, otherwise it wouldn't be here. Unless it's just there in case you missed that ledge, so you've got another one. If you do end up down here, it's pretty easy, there's just a wall run there. Backflip, and you're back up top. To get back over there is pretty easy as well, you just run and jump again. Every little loot you can find in this place is helpful. But as I say, in this big room, you've literally you're just following this tree branch. It goes to all kinds of different areas. <laughs> literally, it is just—it's one of those weird rooms that has loot all over it. So all I can really suggest is when you come in here. Just that big tree in the middle will take you to almost all of them. Just that one down there seems to be fairly hidden. So we'll leave that off here for now. Thanks for watching and I'll catch you next time.